Hi everyone, it's Spiritual OG and I'm coming at you guys for your mid-May 2020 reading for the sign of Taurus, Sun Moon Rising and Venus. Thank you for all your likes, shares, and subscribes. I'm currently offering an email reading special, so if you're interested in that, you can find all that information in the description box below, along with my IG and extended for Vimeo. Taurus, Five of Wands energy. Okay, definitely a lot of abuse going on here. I do feel the Emperor in reverse, but I feel like you're ready for it. Like you're born ready. Okay, some of you guys could be dealing with a Sagittarius or a Scorpio, but I feel like these motherfuckers, they don't even have any idea. And I do feel an energy of mutability, duality. I feel like you're the true emperor and there's a fake emperor here, okay? But somebody is definitely trying to start some shit that they're not prepared for. I feel like somebody's going to be in it. Like, I have to give the message. Somebody's going to end up on their back, okay? Um, also, somebody's chakras are really fucked up, okay? All right, it could be an enemy of yours. Like, somebody's being attacked in regards to their chakras. But I feel like energetically, um, if somebody was doing dark magic on you, um, like, I feel like an energy of deterioration. Like, somebody could be deteriorating, okay? All right? Beloved, I humbly petition. I also feel an energy of, like, a false prophet of some sort. Like, somebody's pretending to be something that they're not. Okay, it could be a high priest or a high priestess, okay? All right, but somebody here is definitely falsifying their identity, okay? I do feel the energy of a doppelganger, but I feel like if somebody is trying to copy you, it's not gonna work. I feel like people know, people are really coming into the information that somebody here is a fraud, okay, that they're fake, all right? Beloved, I humbly petition, please provide messages for the sign of Taurus. Yeah, I feel like the information is going to start like coming out very slowly. I do feel this energy of like the ooze, the secret of the ooze, okay? But with the ace of wands in reverse, there's not gonna be a new beginning. I feel like you're gonna come back this very quickly, okay? Yeah, cause you're dipping with the eight of cups. I feel like some of you guys are definitely escaping a negative situation, okay? All right, and somebody here is definitely having a hard time. I feel like energetically somebody here is stuck Okay, and someone here is being blessed to move forward, okay? Could be dealing with a Leo here. But with the moon card in reverse, definitely a lot of information being revealed, okay? Someone here is definitely being left out in the cold, okay? It could be someone that you had a connection with, with the lovers, but someone here has been dropped. Yeah, but they still want to, you know, commune with you. They still want to have a relationship with you, and they're trying to pull a Lazarus here, okay? All right, could be dealing with a Scorpio, but underneath the deck judgment and reverse so you're the high priest you're the high priestess okay you reign in the heavens okay taurus let me make that known okay heaven is your domain okay and a lot of people they're jealous of that taurus they're jealous of that i'm a pisces i'm a high priestess but i come from a high priest do you understand what i'm saying taurus we can talk like this okay a taurus birthed me a taurus birthed a pisces a hierophant birthed a high priestess so I have respect for Taurus okay but, but but these mother lovers don't okay but the thing about it is beloved in the building with the high priestess high priest energy regardless of energy you know that these mother lovers did you dirty and somebody might call you for help okay with the high priestess yeah cuz somebody here is definitely in trouble because they want a new beginning because things are going very well for you financially with the ten of pentacles but somebody here with the ace of pentacles they're definitely going through a situation in regards to their finances and the sun is going to shine on you beautifully look at the sun shine look at the sun shine okay some of you guys could be dealing with a leo but i do feel this energy of like the lion of judah like you're standing in your power, okay? And you're over bullshit and you have a lot to celebrate with the three of cups in the upright and the three of swords in reverse, okay? Yes, okay, some of you guys are definitely gonna meet your match here, okay? Some of you guys could be celebrities. You may end up dating another celebrity with the star card here, but I definitely feel energetically there's gonna be healing in regards to a relationship that somebody is desiring. Yeah, you definitely fell out of love with this person. They were talking shit. Somebody's got hot breath. Go brush your goddamn teeth, okay? Channeling, pardon my language. Yeah, but you're very happy with the Nine of Cups, okay? But somebody feels there's an injustice in this situation. 444 is going to be very significant, and someone can't move on from you. It's just like they want you to be stuck in this cycle of bullshit, okay? With the 666 here, 
okay? They definitely want you to be stuck in this bullshit. Somebody's trying to pull up shit, okay? Yeah, and you know this. Okay, you're going through an ascension, but someone here is having a tower moment, and they're talking shit about you, okay? Because they mad that you're in your power with the Nine of Pentacles, okay? But they can't reach you. They're talking shit, but they want to apologize. It's like they're talking shit about you behind your back, but they want to apologize at the same time. Yeah, and you're definitely manifesting. You guys are going up. You're moving up in the world. Things are very beautiful in regards to relationships. You guys are definitely going to meet your true counterpart here. Yeah, and somebody wants to come and make an offer with you, but you don't want to have transactions with these people. They're very low vibrational. They come to you with war, okay, especially with the temperance card in reverse and the justice card in reverse. Uh, heavy emphasis in regards to liberties, okay? All right? You don't want to invest in this situation, okay? But this person, it's like they just want to sleep with you with the king of wands. Okay, somebody here is a hoe regardless of gender. Yeah, and you know that with the empress in reverse. Somebody likes to talk a good game with the nine of wands. They like to talk all that smack and shit. Yeah, but they youngsters, okay? I just hear like you're a wankster. You're not even a gangster, okay? Please. Yeah, this is someone from your past, and all they do is watch you work with the eight of pentacles. The number 23 is very significant. Could be dealing with an Aries. Yeah, uh -huh. but this person, they want to have a connection with you, but I do feel like they want to get in your thing. They want to get in that ting ting. See, it looks like a yoni with the four of wands. They want to get through your canal. They want to go through your canal river. You could be dealing with another water sign, but I, that ain't happening. They want that G spot, okay? But the G spot is hidden. It's hidden. You know this, Taurus. Not everybody knows where it is. They don't know where it is. They don't know where to hit it. Not everybody knows. You could be dealing with somebody who's in the medical field. Yeah. Yeah. And you cut this person off big time, but they're very much in love with you. Okay, the number seven is also very significant. Yeah, this person is manipulative. Okay, all right. They're not in tune with their yin energy. It could be a boss figure regardless of gender. We both have yin and yang energy, but somebody's like yin energy is just fractured. Okay, somebody's very low vibrational. I almost feel like both their yin and yang energy is very bad. It's like even their internally, their yin and their yang um, energy, they hate each other. Their own, their, own, their, their own male energy hates their female energy and their own female energy hates their male energy. There's no union within this person. Okay? Yeah, and like... Somebody definitely with the Eight of Swords, okay, I feel like somebody might have a mental breakdown, okay, 747 might be very significant, and they're definitely having a hard time with the Ten of Cups. Somebody's going to definitely have a mental breakdown because they don't have options here, and you know this, but you don't give a fuck. I feel like this person stabbed you, and when you told them the truth about themselves, you just did it with one sword, but you got the biggest sword. Okay, you got the true sword. You got the, the sword of truth. This is the sword of truth. And when you when you serve it to them, when you serve it to them, oh, it cuts deep, darling. It cuts deep. You know, Taurus, when a Taurus tells you the truth, pardon moi. All bets are off with the three of wands in reverse. Okay, and you don't give a fuck. With the two of cups in reverse and the five of cups, you don't give a fuck, all right? And they can be bitchy and mad all they want, okay? But you're going to move forward, okay? you giving somebody the back. you giving somebody your back, okay? And all they're doing is crying over spilled milk, and they don't really have shit to say to you. They're defenseless because once you spit that truth to this individual, it's all done. And all they do is bring this combative bullshit and confusion to your space, and you don't need this. It's like... What does love have to do with this? With the King of Cups here and the Five of Swords, I mean, look at this energy. This is what's surrounding them, okay? So you could be dealing with some situations in the workplace, okay? Yeah, because this person, their word is not bond. With the King of Pentacles, okay, somebody might need to be bailed out of jail here, okay? Yeah, but they need a transformation. You definitely block this person with the Seven of Wands. Yeah, Hierophant in the building. When it's over, it's over. <sighs> Dragon Ball Z, Taurus. Dragon Ball Z, okay? I feel the energy of a hoe. Like, somebody may have been, like, you know, giving oral sex to somebody. 
and somebody's like, you know what? Dragon Ball Z's, okay? Dragon Ball Z's, okay? Because I'm not fucking with you. Yeah, and they don't understand that. With the Ace of Swords, they don't understand that. Underneath the deck, who gives a, who gives a flying fuck? Who gives a flying fuck? Okay? But somebody here about to get it. Somebody about to get it. Somebody gonna have a new asshole torn into them, okay? All right, Taurus. <laughs> you know how to dish it. I love you so much. Email reading special, uh, special at the bottom. Extended for Vimeo. Smooches, honey. Mwah.